noon at the U.S. Naval Academy in Annapolis. Midshipmen gather to march into noon meal. Academy officials offer it gladly to photographers, but not everything here is picture perfect. We've had a couple of untoward incidents here over the past couple of weeks. Untoward incidents? Annapolis police picked up two students Monday charged with misdemeanor burglary. Last week, two more arrested on sex charges. Another one indicted on federal charges of involvement in a car theft ring. Add in last year's case of 24 students caught cheating, and it appears some midshipmen aren't following this mission statement. Superintendent Admiral Charles Lawson ordered the stand down, he says, to give midshipmen time to reflect on ethics. But ethics for midshipmen are nothing new. The Naval Academy has long had an entire department devoted to teaching ethics and the law. Two weeks ago, the Washington Post ran a guest column criticizing the Academy. It was written by one of the school's ethics teachers, Dr. James Barry. In it, he says the Navy's worst traditions of loyalty and lies are being passed on. And when trouble comes... You don't speak the truth. You do, you do not speak the truth. You cannot speak the truth. Keep your mouth shut. There's a message. That's what they're learning. That's what they're learning. After his article was published, Barry was temporarily reassigned. He's back now teaching the ethics administrators admit students need. We don't tolerate that. We root it out. And if we find people who don't meet those standards, they're gone. But gone to where? Graduation is just 36 days away. So far, there's been no decision on whether the two midshipmen arrested this week will graduate or not.